Hello and welcome with another video. I am Professor Dr. Moina Mughal from Dr. Mekazi Institute of Chemistry, University of St. Jamjaro. Right now, I am in my office and I just needed to um, convey a few points to my students who are knocking my door again um, for multiple times and uh, just because as I have announced the date for your examination, uh, uh, semester examination for the lab, organic chemistry lab, Chem 503. So, um, I thought that I must convey you about the patron exam. I have distributed the patron exam. It's here with me right now in the, my mobile. I've seen it. Now the patron for uh, the ex practical examination is being provided to you. Your coursework was to identify to explore different organic compounds which we have uh, done it nicely in the lab. And But now uh, it's the time to prove yourself, to prove uh, what you have learned from us, the teachers, right? So now you will be, uh, you you have gone through, I mean, all those four steps uh, to identify any known or unknown organic compound. I have given you, uh, provided you the known compounds also and the unknown also. And I hope you know what is the meaning of known and unknown now. So now, um, you will be asked um, to write down i mean the equations related to your reactions and you will be asked uh, um, you can you could be asked i mean uh, about the reagents that why such and such reagent was used as for example why this 2,4 dinitrophenyl hydrazine is used in and uh, what is the name of it, that particular test so just like that, I mean, uh, you will be asked very simple, these, are th these questions and these things, the pattern which has been provided to you, it seems very simple, seems very easy for, uh, for, I mean, for you people also and for us also because I don't find anything difficult in it and it's something everyone should supposed to, uh, to I mean, uh, do nicely. So in, uh, you, you have seen in the pattern, that we have provided you choices uh, also in every i mean the questions two questions we are asking you we are uh, we put uh, or a choice in between those two questions also so you have a vast choice in every two questions you are uh, you have been provided one choice so uh, and you will some students were asking me that whether we were supposed we are supposed to do it on the question paper you will write it down on the question paper or we will be given the extra sheets so you will be provided the extra sheets for uh, i mean this writing in completing your uh, uh, lab exam and then uh, of course uh, we will we would expect that you know the reactions and the mechanisms behind those reactions um, you know why we uh, why we use certain chemicals why that reaction progressed in I mean this direction or that direction and um, there then in the end there is a question about the boiling and the melting points of your organic compounds now I have explained you how to record the boiling and melting point and this is the very you know basic level questions question which you are supposed to complete and do it and I hope that you will be able to do it. and again there is also a choice we have given you a choice in between the boiling and the melting point to write down their procedures, the way how you can record the melting point of an organic compound, how you can, I mean, record because uh, you that was the last step which you did in every experiment. So that's it. And uh, now I, as just as I announced the date for the exam, which is uh, 15th of uh, this month, that is May, uh 2023 15th august 15th may 2023 i mean uh, there um, my door is being constantly knocked by i mean um, by students you are all coming to me now for what for one reason which i am not following for getting your journals checked your lab lab uh, log books checked i mean your log books are still unchecked and i told you in my various demos that you are supposed to i mean uh, uh, you are supposed to get your uh, result uh, results checked on the day of your performance but you never obeyed that and you are coming up with different reasons 
so now get ready for the I mean response from your teacher also right you know I'm going to put the remarks on it and the remark you know I, I I've told you uh, that on if you will find a, a remark on your a negative remark of course on your logbook or on your journal that means your marks would be deducted right you have you your total marks are hundred and your marks will be deducted on every late submission so just uh, keep that thing in your mind that uh, now it's your time is over and now it's our time it's the examination time so you get ready for the results and I mean I, w I, have, I was uh, totally cooperating with you the whole semester and I was coming in, in the month of Ramzan also, but you people were not turning uh, turning up. You were not coming to me. You were not asking anything. I was uh, present in my office, but you would never came to me. Anyway, I wish you a very good luck for your exam. I wish you, uh, I mean, uh, very, very good luck for your exams. Get ready. Go through your schemes. This, this is your lab scheme I have with you. This is your lab scheme. So please go through this lab screen right and it has got the reactions and everything after that so go through the tests for all the i mean um, reactions you have done and you should know what were the methods of preparations i mean uh, different preparations and you should know uh, i mean why we did the classification test why we did all those four steps to come identify our organic compound so that's all for today thank you very much i hope you have now followed how you will be um, you will be you will be i mean given the exam and how the exam will be conducted thank you very much